Good morning, everybody. I'm doing this uh, little, little silly video on the way to work. Um, my mom uh, asked me to do some happier videos because she says maybe I'll get more followers if I do happier videos. So I'm going to try to do a happy video. I don't know. Like, my truth is uh, a lot of sadness, so I speak about it because... Not a lot of people do. Like, not a lot of people talk about the darkness, what they went through when they were using. And, uh, you know, like, I think it's really important to shed light on that type of stuff. But anyway, yeah, so I'm going to talk about some happy stuff, stuff that's going on, like what I'm doing. Uh, you know, just like helping a lot of kids right now, doing stuff with the Newport Academy in Bethlehem, Connecticut, helping uh, one of my son's friends you know, get and stay clean, and, you know, like, I have these wonderful, beautiful children in my life that love me and that I love, and, you know, I talk about uh, being famous in their eyes and just raising them the best way that I can, and that's all I'm trying to do, man, like, just raise my kids, love my kids, uh, provide for them, provide for their future so that um, when my body passes on eventually, I know they're fully supported, and... I only need to be famous in their eyes. I just need to have them be proud of me and and love me and be their hero, man. And um, that's uh, that's what life's all about for me. That's my purpose in life. Those those beautiful children, you know. I have I have four kids and I have a couple step kids. And even though I'm divorced, they're still my kids, man. Uh, I raised those boys, and I love them so much. I love all my kids so, so much. And, you know, I just want to talk a little bit about my mom and how she's supported me through my whole life. You know, it's been um, really hard for her. I put her through hell, you know. I uh, In and out of recovery and, and lots of relapses, and, you know, she helped me a lot. You know, she always supported me no matter what, and I love her dearly, and, you know, I don't know, I don't know how to make a super happy video, but life is amazing, man, like, uh, like, all the things that I'm doing, I'm so honored and blessed, and, and, you know, it, I come from a place of humility and, and being humble, and, Wow, like my ego just doesn't get in the way right now and uh, I try to keep it in check on a daily basis and like I said, life is so amazing, like there's so much joy and, and so much happiness and everything from, from, you know, just the sun rising and me taking my, you know, my first breath in the morning when I wake up, the first breath that I realize I'm taking and, and you know, like that's happiness for me, you know, like... I talk about, you know, this little joyous moment I had in, um, in rehab and how self-love was uncovered. Uh, you know, I did this meditation and I was really afraid to do it. I thought a lot of really bad stuff was going to come up. And, you know, I did like a positive affirmation in the beginning of it. And I quickly forgot what that affirmation was, but the end result of that meditation was just complete and total self-love. I felt it in my entire body, and, you know, like, that's happiness for me, man. Like, being able to love myself today and not taking shit from people, like, knowing my worth, you know, like, knowing that I'm worth a good life, I'm worth staying clean, I'm worth helping others and not letting people walk over or walk all over me anymore. Like, I always did that my whole life because I didn't feel worth it, you know, and I'm worth it today. And, and that goes for my job, not letting my boss walk all over me or relationships, intimate relationships, not letting them treat me poorly and knowing how to say no to people. Like, I never could say no to people. So all of that right there is like, is my happiness, man. And like, you know, a lot of it just comes from meditation. Like I meditate every single day. I'm really in tune to what my body tells me. I'm really in, in tune and aware of my thoughts when they, when they turn negative or when ego comes up. I'm able to really flip negative into positive now. And you know, like I said, all that comes from just, like, really diligent practice, like, daily practice. It's not just like, oh, I'm going to sit at temple once a week with Ajahn. 
you know, like that's great and, and amazing to do, but I need to practice every single day. If, if I want and desire to be liberated from suffering that I need to put in the work. So that's what I'm doing. So like I said, like life is amazing, you know, like, you know, I said yesterday, and I took a picture yesterday when I woke up, the first thing I saw was the sun rising over my cousin's truck, my cousin who passed away. And, and um, in that moment, I realized the joy was over the sadness. And I wasn't attaching to either of those things. And, and uh, it was just this harmonious equanimity I could see in between both of them and you know for me that's uh that's enlightenment man like that is um that's that's liberation from suffering you know and I don't feel that all the time but I get glimpses here and there so I know what I'm doing and how I'm practicing is uh a, a clear path to liberation and it's uh it's amazing like you know once once we get to that liberated state like there there is no happiness there is no joy there is no pain there is no suffering it's just equanimity and uh that's the goal that's the end goal right there you know so everybody be happy today may all beings be happy may you be happy sabe sata suki hotu may all beings be happy suki hotu may you be happy I love all of you so much and I hope you guys get a kick out of the funny ears and the rabbit teeth and the cupcake and I wish I could eat cupcakes but I'm lactose intolerant and that makes me sad. No, I'm just a happy dude, man. And um, I love everybody and I love you, mom. I love you, kids. Everybody's amazing. Be kind to one another. Have compassion for one another. Recover loudly. Speak your truth. Don't ever let anyone tell you otherwise you know like be true to yourself you know and uh get yourself out there i'll love my friends i see cops so i'm gonna put my phone down have a good day